And there's something to be said about going away for a week, guys. What size air pump am I using on my reef glass skimmer? You know, it's not horrible, but I don't like to see it. Hey guys, I'm back from vacation. Almost got divorced twice. Last day. If you think you're in a time warp, you are. The move completely fell apart. The move just didn't happen. My wife, Sylvia, just kind of encouraged me and we're gonna hang out here for a couple more years make more videos and there's something to be said about going away for a week guys everything looks really nice I got some new furniture coming for the guest room slash studio slash reef tank slash everything room in here all right, guys, before we go any further, I want to just update you on what happened while I was gone. Here you go. Your mind, bro? B roll, that's all. Nice. Hold it up. Change Wednesday. Here we go. I don't get enough questions yet, guys, so I'll take comments too and I'll respond to them. John asks, 
what size air pump am I using on my reef glass skimmer? And he was having trouble with it uh, creating larger bubbles, not the micro bubbles. So I use the Stellar pump and it's rated at 10 to 20 gallons. And that seems to make the perfect size bubbles for me and I can control it with that little knob on the top. All right, still a bit too much hair algae for me, guys. This is about one week from my last water change. And you can still see it's there. And it's not decreasing at all. You know, it's not horrible, but I don't like to see it. All right, Lutosh says, like that music. The music I play, guys, in my videos, I try to make some kind of connection, a feeling with the music to what I'm showing you in the video. That's all. So I'm glad you like that. Here it is, guys. This is getting me a little annoyed. I keep taking it out, so after the test, we're going to come in here with my fingers, and we're going to remove this and see what happens again. And I'm going to start dosing with lanthanum to get rid of this stuff. Look at it growing on the snails. A couple videos ago, I showed some ocean scenes and then asked, what draws you into reef keeping? So E30s and reefs, I think a big reason why I like my tank so much is because in a way we get to play God. We can see our corals grow and flourish thanks to us keeping up good parameters and clean water. Also the beautiful colors on the fish and on the corals. And there's something to be said about going away for a week, guys. Everything looks really nice. All I did was clean the glass off here. And I fed a little bit last night. The clown is starting to make a home in the leather coral. There he is. Making a home in the leather coral. The leather is hosting the clown, as they would say. Here's another one from John about the refugium light that you saw in the video when I went over to my brother's. That's a nano glow light. He rests it on top of the hang off the back refugium. You can mount those on the side. Actually, it's designed to be mounted on the side because there's a magnet that comes with it. But in his case, the magnet then has to go down inside the box. So when the light comes on, it'll shine right into your tank. And if you're doing reverse photo period, that means all night long you're getting a lot of light directly into your tank and you may not want that. My SPS here, my Digitata has made a full comeback and my Stylophora seems to be coming back too in some areas it's growing back in. But you see those? Hermits are still on there. The green star polyp has still not grown over my SPS. That's the Hosolopora frag up there that's all over the place now. And the yellow acro up there. And the acros down here look really good. New growth coming off the front. Hmm. Hmm. Look at the zoas, all puffy and looking great. So, something to be said about not getting your hands in the tank. Alright guys, good to be back. We'll get back on track. Sunday video, water change Wednesday. Have a great day. I gotta do some cleaning up and re-unpacking. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care now. So I have to say, I really miss making the videos, guys. I missed you guys. It just doesn't want to focus today. Maybe it's a little rusty. Let's see. This is why. She knows I'm doing a video.
just made the video again. Come on. Come on. Ah, my f***ing blurry.